Hey guys, what's up? It is Pizza Prestige, and welcome to this brand new series of Planet Coaster in which we build Park Miranda. And Park Miranda is a park uh, which has an entrance building that is uh, actually um, kind of copied, not really copied, but mainly inspired by Chateau Noisy or, um, well, Chateau Miranda or Castle Miranda, or how you want to call it. It's in the, the southern part of Belgium. A lot of you might know it. Well, a lot of you, uh, some of you, um, it's an urban exploring location, which means that basically it's an it's an abandoned castle in real life, and it's super duper creepy. You can look it up. It, uh, there's a link in the description down below. Maybe you can click on it and you can see the castle as it looks now. And you know, I get the chills just looking at the pictures. I really want to go there sometime, uh, but it, it seems pretty dangerous. You know, the the owners of the uh, building are pretty aggressive. Uh, there's even been uh, people who got shot at. So. About that, I'm not so sure. So I thought, you know what, let's just rec <laughs> recreate it in uh, Planet Coaster. And, you know, I must say, I feel pretty happy about it. Um, the thing is, you know, it's, it's super creepy. And how do you make it happy or happy enough or, you know, comforting enough um, to actually use it as an entrance for your park? And that was a, you know... I, I thought about this a lot, uh, you know, I was thinking, you know, I should I should totally start a new park in Planet Coaster, I should make videos again, and I thought, you know, I really want to use this castle, but how? And I just kept thinking about it, and at a certain moment, I just thought, you know what, let's just do it, let's wing it, and we'll see how it goes. Uh, so this is kind of a thing that we do by trial and error, and we just see what we come up with, you know, uh, where, we, where we end with this, and I just hope it turns out alright, and I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, as much as I did making it, you know, um, um, it's it's good to be back. It's um, I, I can't say that I'm uh, I'm permanently back. Of course, uh, I have been doing some life-changing stuff lately, and uh, you know, some things in my career path that have changed. I really want to talk about those things, but I'm not going to do that in these videos. These are just going to be about the game, not about you know my life. Uh, I might do some vlogs sometime if you guys are interested in knowing uh, what's going on. Um, just let me know if you want that, you know, uh, I might do it on another channel or on this channel, uh, whatever, we'll see. But yeah, going back to the game, I used to play Planet Coaster like I played Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 in which, you know, I just started with a path and kept on adding things, uh, roller coasters, flat rides, restaurants or whatever, stalls. And now, you know, I didn't really want to do that. I have been playing Planet Coaster for a while and my previous parks have also been like that. There was no planning ahead, uh, basically. And that just, you know, it, it creates a messy park. That's what I've seen for myself. And I thought, you know, I could, I can do better than that. So I thought, let's go ahead and plan a little bit. So I got some paper, started doodling a little bit on it, you know, and tried to come up with pa park layouts that actually made sense. And this grand entrance, you know, it's, it's kind of the big deal before we start with a park. So when, once we get this down, we can start on the main uh, street area of the park. And then, you know, branch off into the different parts of the park that interconnect like a giant roundabout uh, in the center of the park. I'm not sure what that's going to be. Maybe around a lake or around a mountain or whatever. We'll see about that. Um, but there's going to be some cool planning involved. And I'm going to take you along with the journey to, you know, create a park um, that actually looks like a real park. And hopefully not a real scary park <laughs> like it does kind of right now uh, as I'm beginning the construction of this castle, Castle Miranda. And I must say I'm really happy with the result of the clock tower. Uh, unfortunately, the clock doesn't really fit on the triangle that I placed there. I know Illuminati, Illuminati confirmed. I, I just can't change anything about that. I just like the shape and uh, it's also there on the real castle. But I really like the spire, you know, the, the four little towers that go up on the corners and the kind of widening of the tower at the top. And also the wings that are going to be on both sides of the, the tower. Uh, they're going to be asymmetrical, which I'm really skeptic about, you know. I always like things that are symmetrical, but for this, I think the best one, is, the best idea is to just wing it like it's on the pictures. And um, if you want to see the pictures, go ahead and click on the link on the uh, click on the link in the description. I already told you that in the beginning of the video, but I just repeat it. Um, you know, if you want to know it, if you want to see it, you can just look it up real quick. Um, <laughs> yeah, but. You know, that's that's basically uh, what this video is about. It's just starting the entrance area. Now you can see me do a little bit of terraforming right here. Uh, not really terraforming, but just 
texture painting of the of the ground and I must say you know in some uh, some of the uh, what actually you know came to mind is in some of the sandbox modes uh, some of the parks you actually have different textures to use on the ground um, so I actually decided to go with the I think this is a tropical um, the tropical sandbox and I think it's gonna work out fine now just adding some lights for the castle as you can see I really like the way that the first hallway is kind of lit up and I like the uh, the railings on both of the sides of the walls and this is you know the thing so far so let me know what you think do you think that this is a better idea you know to really put a lot of detail in there or maybe is it better to just wing it and see where we end up anyhow I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video. So until then, peace from Pieces of Prestige.